What's up guys, welcome back to our channel. So in today's video, we're gonna show you how we build this mirror for under $20. And this is the materials that you're gonna need. So, let's get started. So we got our, mit our miter saw set up for a 30 degree angle and we're gonna cut a 30 degree angle coming down this way. And then the next step we're gonna do is measure from this bottom point over to how big of a width we want and cut a 30 degree angle coming in this way. So it's gonna end up looking like that. And we're going to cut six of these boards out, identical in size, and then we'll put them all together like a puzzle piece. So here we go, we'll start with this one first. So we're gonna measure from the bottom here over 14 and 3 eighths. And that's gonna be the width of the bottom here. And like I said, we're gonna come back in. We're gonna cut an angle, but coming in the opposite way. So it'll look like that. So we're gonna head on back over to the saw and cut this piece off. So instead of actually going through the process and flipping your miter back over to the other side every time you want to do a cut. You can actually just do um, what's easier is just make your mark and you actually just flip your board over to the opposite side and that way the saw is already cut up set for the angle that you need it. So that's what we did and now we're going to cut this piece out. All right, so now that we have our first piece cut out, what we can do is actually just use this piece as a template to cut out the rest of the boards. We need five more boards just like this one. So what I'm gonna do is just take the one that we have, lay it down on the board, make sure it's nice and even, score a line, and then go cut it on the saw. Uh, when you use a board as a template, one of the things that you wanna keep in mind is use the same board every time for your template. Don't cut another piece out, put your first one to the side, and then use your second one. You always wanna use the first cut as your template. So that's what we're gonna do. Lay it down, score the line, and keep cutting. Show me your score line. <laughs> Okay, door. <laughs> Ta -da! Okay, so now that we have all of our pieces cut and they're all sanded, we've laid them out here and we're going to start marking our boards. So when we go back to put them together, we know exactly what board goes next to each other. So I'll show you how we're going to do this. So I'm going to mark them like one and one, two, two, and then now we can work on attaching these boards, and we're going to we're going to do that by using our Craig jig, and I'll link below where you can find the Craig jigs if you want to purchase one. And with this, how we're gonna do this is we're actually going to just put a couple marks right where we want to drill the holes for the Craig and we're gonna do that towards the inside of the boards. And what does a Craig jig make? Pocket, pocket holes. holes. Pocket holes, oh, okay. We only have to do a Craig jig on one side of each board. We don't need to do it going this way. We can just go do it going this way. It'll be perfectly fine, but you want to make sure you at least do two. Okay, so now we have all the boards with their, the Craig Jig holes in there. And we're gonna just use our glue bot and start gluing them. Put some glue on the end. 
line it up, and then we'll drill it in. <laughs> That's so cool. <laughs> Pretty neat, right? So now what we're going to do is we're going to give this whole thing a really good sanding and then we'll, we're going to start creating the raised edge around the frame and then we can go ahead, paint it, stain it, whatever you want to do and then we can attach the mirror on the back and then we have a cute wood framed mirror. It came together pretty quick so far. Yeah. Not bad. So we have our one by two boards that we're gonna to use to frame in our mirror. So I'm gonna show you a simple way on how to get these angles. These are gonna be 30 degree angles anyway, or they're gonna also be 30 degree angles. But if you take your board and you set it directly underneath your frame, make sure it's lined up. Okay. And then you can just mark here, go to the other side, mark there, and you have your two marks, where to cut it. When you cut it, you have this out of the board, right? And then you flip it, and then you have your side, and you can do that all the way around. Once you have all of your edges cut, then you can start to go ahead and start brad nailing everything in. So what we do is we just take a little bit of wood glue, put it on the edge there, line it up, get your corners flush where they need to go, use your brad nailer to pin them in. And we're using one and a quarter inch brad nails for this job. Okay, so we got the frame all on, nice and cute. And now we're just gonna give everything a nice sanding and then we are going to move to putting our finish on. Okay guys, well, I hope you enjoyed today's video. Yes, and again, if you like these videos, please give us a thumbs up. Leave a comment below, tell us how we're doing, tell, if you, tell us if you like what you see, or give us ideas about things that you might want to see, um, and maybe we can put it together for you and mm -hmm. show you an easy way to do it. So please hit the subscribe button, hit the bell, ding, 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 that's tell you when all our videos come out. Um, and again, thank you for all your support, and thanks for watching. Yep, and we'll see you next time. You Bye, next everyone. Time. Fix my man bun. <laughs> All right, it's growing in. All right, guys. Well, I hope you wait. Where's your camera thing right there? Okay. I don't know. I just stare at the camera. You don't want to stare at yourself. You want to stare at this. I'm not. I'm Oops. staring at the hot lady next to me. Mm. Mm. You tuck it behind. My you. man bun is growing in fabulous. It's growing in fabulous. <laughs> All right. It's almost a mullet. Oh. <laughs> All right. If it gets to that point, I will cut your hair. Okay. I only agree on if it gets to that point. Okay. Deal. Okay. All right, guys. Tell me again. <laughs> Why are you so short? You need like a box to stand on. Maybe you should just crouch down. I have bad knees. <gasps> What'd you do? All right, anyway. Little knees down. Boy, I'm not that short. Alright, anyway.
You got Corona? No, I have sawdust. <laughs> <laughs> What's up, guys? Welcome back to our channel. Merry and Christmas. What did I tell you? I have to edit this shit. <laughs> The more goofing off you do, it takes longer, and I would like to have tomorrow off. <laughs> so, why do you need tomorrow off? Oh, because I want a day off. It's Monday. Anyway, day. anyway, what's up, guys? Welcome back to our channel. So, in today's video, we're going to show you how we build this mirror. Whatever. So, let's get chopping. So, stop looking at me. Every time I see something, I'm gonna, saying not to talk so and make get, it too long. So I'm like, so let's do it. If I say so, can't you just say, let's get started? Okay. So let's get started. No. Say you say so. Let's get started. So let's get started. Yeah, that's good. 